Hello everyone, my name is Mohammed Hassan. I am a user experience designer and I am seeing a very very strange kind of trend these days that a lot of designers or mainly user experience designers they think that Figma is the only thing that a UX designer need to learn or a tool. So depending on a tool or investing too much time in a tool I think is uh, not an option for a great user experience designer. So there are a lot of other things that needs and have more priority than learning a tool. Okay, so tool is necessary. It is necessary. For example, you want to quickly create some wireframes or a simple prototype to test with your users. Main thing you are missing over here is users you need to test your things with the users useless animations or uh, i'm seeing a lot of designers they tend to make a lot of strange kind of you know uh, animations with figma like you know pages are moving around and you know transition effects and all the, those things these are good for experimentation but in reality if you look at any good companies app there is a very very limited usage of animations google's gmail app if you use it use it on your phone you can use outlook or any other app you are using instagram uh, twitter there are very very minimal usage of animations because they are going to waste time of the users if you are transit using a transition effect that is going to be like taking one or two or three seconds this is a wastage you are wasting time of your users users need urgent uh, you know uh, urgent data or whatever they are looking for their their goals are to reach there as soon as possible so there is a good chance that you might need some animation to delight your user but in a good way. For example, if I am waiting for my pizza, that is a good place for the animation. You can use a, a, a SVG animation and SVG animation over there that a guy is making pizza and flipping it again and again. So this is going to be very delightful for me while I am waiting for the pizza. But while I'm using an app or I'm transitioning from one screen to another, I don't need those Figma animations. So First thing is that try to focus on your users and try to see and don't waste your time learning too many Figma tricks or watching too many Figma tutorials. I have seen some junior designers that they don't know the basics of, you know, layout or uh, column design or, uh, you know, grid, soft grid or hard grid and they are working on different animations in Figma. So this is actually happens when you try to follow different tutorials so don't try to follow tutorials aimlessly if you really need something to build for example i'm working uh, in a car manufacturer uh, and i want to design the dashboard of the car speedometer then i might need to use some animation that I, I need to look for different animation tutorials if i need to use some advanced uh, animation other than that, I think most of the time, 90% of the time, you don't need advanced Figma prototyping or advanced Figma animations or advanced Figma tools to create a prototype or design for your websites or web apps, okay? So this, uh, the, the reason of this video is that I have seen an article with the same name and it inspired me a lot of another designer. I don't know the name. Uh, I read it on Medium that he was also uh, worried about the same thing that Figma is not UX. Okay, so I hope you understand and uh, I would love to see your comments. So if you have any suggestions, you can always um, put something in the comments and I would love to reply them. I will see you soon in another video uh, with more things about user experience design, UI design, of course. Till then, take care. Bye bye.